everyone, and welcome to Connections Wellness Wake Up with uh, me and Charlie. Um, we are here today to do some flower perfume. So I like to call it flower perfume, but it's actually rose water, and Charlie's going to make it for us. And it's actually a perfect craft to do today because it's actually Earth Day today. So happy Earth Day to everyone. All right, Charlie, shall we start? Yes, that's just part of the flower. So we have lots of fun stuff here, and Charlie's going to be doing, or mixing, some roses. We've got some roses here, some rose petals. They're dry, but you can use freshes if you want as well. And Charlie's just gonna put that in our jar, and I'll put this here to help her stuff. Keep it in the jar. And Charlie's going to put about, what do you think, Charlie? How much should we put? 30 scoops? Yeah, I think we did. Because last Yeah, last time we did. We did quite a few last time, right? Yeah. yeah, I think so. What do you think? There we go. Lots of roses. How do they smell? Oh, it smells good. <laughs> More? Okay. <laughs> and now Charlie's going to do... Or I should say, add some water. Oops, let me go big girl. And this is just a really fun activity for the kids because they get to scoop and fill, and they learn about measuring cups and whatnot. And I should say measurements. And Charlie's just gonna fill it up with water, and you can use any kind of water, distilled water, just regular water. Just gonna fill it up. It's a fun science experiment too, because we can talk about the flowers floating, and then once we shake it up, we'll see the water turn pink. pink. <sighs> Do you like doing this craft? Hmm. You think that's enough? Thank you. A little bit more. Oh, I hope we can mix it. All right, let's. Mix it up. What do we do now? Ah, oh, there's a top. Make sure it's on tight, 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 tight. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> and now Terry's gonna mix, 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 mix. Keep mixing. Mix, 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 mix. And it's a fun craft too because they can do it pretty quickly. It doesn't have to sit around. Mix, mix, mix. <laughs> yeah. What do you think? It looks pretty pink. Some more? That's perfect. What do you think? Awesome. So now, what are we going to do next? I think we have to put it in here, right? We're going to strain it next. All right, big girl. You ready? And I'm going to just use this for now. You can also oh use cheesecloth. Yeah, that's okay. You can also use cheesecloth if you really want to get all the stuff out. Well, it's up to you. You, just dump it. you can just dump it. Yes. Ah! Oh, look how pink it is. It's so pink. I don't think it's gonna fit. No, I don't think so. But we don't need to put all of it. There we go. And I'm just gonna put this extra rose in here. Not like roses in there. There we go. All right. So I noticed we have a few roses in there and didn't quite make it. So now... It's okay. It's cute. <laughs> they won't fit in that little tiny one. No, that's true. So now, Charlie's going to put it in their little perfume bottle. And then she gets to play with it. And if you don't have a pure perfume bottle, you can always use one of those bottles that the spritz one. Because basically what you can do with this is you can use it to... Can you put a cloth up through this? Well, what I'm going to do... Ooh, maybe we should put a cloth, although we've lost our cloth, how did we? One second, girl. I'll be right back. I have a cloth right here in case we make a big mess. Let's put it underneath. There we go. And I'll hold it for you. Is that okay? Put that. There we go. And Charlie's going to put in her perfume Is bottle. Oh, this way like ours. Mm -hmm. well, go for it. Don't get on hand. <laughs> Pink. It is. Oh, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> That's okay. It's going in. <laughs> I 
making funny gurgly sounds. <laughs> uh oh, that's okay. Um, Alright, do you want to put the lid on? It's all the way at the top. There we go. And I made sure to use flowers that you can that she can spritz on her hair and her hands as well. So and they're organic flowers too, which is kind of fun. Alright, you wanna show us how we spritz oh. it in the air? Wait, let me dry this first. Alright, let's dry it up. And like I said, if you don't have a little perfume bottle, you can always use just a little bottle and you can spritz it around one of those. What are those called? Just those water bottles. All right, go for it. Face? Wherever you want, because it's roses. It's like your face? No, on your hands. Want to do it on your hands? And do it in the air? Oh, is it working? Sometimes it needs a few seconds. <gasps> Does it smell good? It's just air. Is it? Let's try it here. Sometimes it takes a little bit to get the bottle going. Oh, I hope it's not broken. I think we've used it so much. You're supposed to spritz in the air. There it goes! We got it! <laughs> now it's just air. Oh, it's, maybe it's the way I'm doing it. Oh, there we go. Do you see it? It's spritzing in the air. Put some on your, in your skin. Does it smell good? I can't smell it because it's all in there. There you go. On your hands? It smells really nice, actually. I can't smell it. You no? Know? Mmm, smells nice. So Charlie's probably going to end up playing with this all day. <laughs> now if you're looking for, ooh! <laughs> Alright Charlie, if you're looking for other things to do, this we're doing with water, and it won't keep very long, it really is just a game to play. But you can also make with any kind of citrus peel, if you put it in vinegar and you let it sit for a couple of weeks, there's your cleaner, and you can use it, mix it with water after, so you would strain it and then you can mix it with water, or you can just use the, the vinegar straight as is for cleaning and whatnot. Another one that we actually just did this morning too, me and Charlie, is um, an infused oil. This one is a really fun one to do, and this is great for cooking as well. We just fill it up with some, here we used pepper uh, flakes, and we just put some oil in there, and you just leave it on your windowsill for a couple of weeks, and then you can strain it. And you can cook with it. And you can do this with lots of other oils as well. Tons of other herbs. Just make sure they're dried herbs when you do it. And you fill up your bottle all the way up with oil. And you can even use it to make some nice ointments and whatnot. So I guess that's it for us, I'm right? flowers on me because it's not going on me. No. Silly girl. Well, as you can see, Charlie really enjoys this craft. And we do it often. So it's a lot of fun to play with flowers, especially if you pick them yourself in your garden. So... I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a wonderful day, and we'll see you soon. Bye. Silly girl.